Hey guys, Megalogan73 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a controllable sackbot in Little Big Planet 2. So, uh, let me just show you an example of what it's going to look like. It's going to look just like this. So you can uh, jump in it and control it. Okay, so first, obviously, you're going to need a sackbot. Alright, sackbot. Oh, got it. Okay. So, uh, I recommend making it big, like as big as you can, um, because the controlinator will be right in front of your poor sackbot, and you won't be able to see its beautiful face. Okay, so you want to make it as big as you can. That's what I recommend. You don't have to do that, but I recommend it. So then you're going to want to get a... Oops. Ah. You want to get a hologram, make it as thin as possible, and shrink it as small as you can. So when it stops shrinking, it should look like this. Okay, so if, if you want to do what I do, you can change the color of the hologram to blue and the brightness all the way down to 0%. That way it's almost impossible to see. So you want to put it right in front of the stack bottle. Let's just pause it. Uh, let's make him neutral right now so that he doesn't move. Okay, so you want to put that right in front there. Then what you want to get out is a connector, a bolt. Shrink the bolt as small as possible. Um, the sackbot... <coughs> <coughs> sorry. We just need to sit up the sackbot so that he's sitting up so that we can bolt this on. Ah. No. Okay. Let's try this again. There. Once you hear that uh, tool sound, uh, it means that it's glued. So basically, um, it's, yeah, glued or uh, connected to the sackbot. So how I did that is I grabbed the hologram and the bolt, the bolted hologram, the bolt that's on the hologram. God, I can't speak. Okay. <clears throat> Grab the bolt that's on the hologram and hold X down as if you're gluing something. Now, what you want to do is get out a controller and put it right here. Okay? Uh, you can shrink that. You don't need to. So, open up the this uh, circuit board for the sackbot and you want to put another one right here. Alright, so you want to um, tweak this and put remote control receiver right here. So make the tag color whatever you want. Leave it as blue if you want. That's what I do. Um, and you want to leave this override sackbot as yes. Okay. So then now you want to edit this one and put remote control transmitter. So make this, make it the same color as the other one, blue or whatever. And then uh, you can change the trigger radius of how big you want the sackbot to respond to. And there you go. You have a, your own little controllable sackbot. And you can change the costume, or you can put copy owner. So see, it just changed to me. You can put copy player one, copy player two, copy player three, copy player four. So that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and um, I'll continue to do these tutorials. If you have any ideas or suggestions of what I should teach you guys how to make, uh, just put it in the comments below. And thank you for watching, and bye.